The general physical examination of the pregnant woman normally involves the exposed parts of the body and provides information about the general state of health, belt hydration, vital signs, and then examination of the head extremities and then weight and height. But before that, we will have taken a history and made a summary to involve the age, parity, occupation, followed by the key points of the history in one or two sentences. General impression about the state of health of the woman is being given and we have moved on to inspect the eyes for pallor, looking at the conjunctiva and looking at the sclera for jaundice, examining the tongue and the mouth and the teeth, particularly looking at the under surface of the tongue. The neck is being examined for lymph and large lymph node enlargements and the anterior part of the neck is being examined for uh, thyroid enlargement. Now the vital signs are going to be taken beginning with the blood measurement of the blood pressure and following that the pulse is taken, the radial pulse is usually what is taken and then you move to the extremities standing at the foot end of the bed and check for pedal edema. You locate the medial malleolus and use the pulp of your thumb, press on it gently for about 10 to 15 seconds and check for dipping which will signify edema. We now measure the height, making the woman stand against a measured part on the wall and letting her raise the neck and look straight up. Then she stands on the scale for measurement of the weight.